Yo, 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 what is going on, YouTube? It is your boy, Pat Proverbs, here from One End Fucking Gaming. And sticking with the theme of Black Ops 2 being more entertaining to watch and, and really having all those attributes of, of a game that, um, even, you know, this far out from launch, still has, um, in my opinion... All you know, everything necessary to, to, to continue to play and, and continue to have fun playing and, and still getting better at the game. And um, honestly, so basically, what you guys are seeing right now is something of a even though it's on our upload schedule, meaning we uploaded Saturday, so we upload Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, it's something of a special upload because um, this has been in my treasure chest of games to upload for a very long time and we're going to talk a lot more about it here in a second uh, about three minutes into the game we'll really start talking about it so it's it's multi-team hardpoint at its at its peak um, when multi, the multi-team playlist was still relatively liquid as far as the amount of players that were in it and and basically being able to get a, a hardpoint game on a relatively consistent basis because I you know who the fuck wants to play kill confirmed or TDM or Whatever, the, yeah, kill confirmed TDM, hard point. Um, and this is uh, my boy Kyle, and you'll notice that this is a party gameplay. Um, he's the only one running lethals. In fact, he's one of those assholes that I mentioned in the past video that uh, when he ran lethals, he would run three lethals. And uh, this game could have been a lot bigger. And this is where we'll kind of, I guess, transition in a little early to why. This game holds sentimental value to at least he and I. Um, I'm not sure Wannabe was even aware back then of the beef we had with that shitbag team, uh, Pulverized Gaming, who, as far as I know, like with any luck, they all choked on their dinner or their own vomit and just fucked the hell off. Um, I think they're gone. I'm not sure if they are or not. I mean, in my mind, they are, because they were ass anyway. Um, and you'll remember that special upload we put in uh, with them just getting the handle three games in a row uh, when they wanted to play us competitively. Variant rules, they got the ill scrape, the ball bag, the jump shot nutsack, um, the bat wing. But here we go, pause the game. Notice in the bottom left who just joined the game. Oh, the old leader of Pulverized Gaming. And there it is for you guys who couldn't see that because of the resolution. There you go, bottom team, middle slot. Look who just joined the game. You session joining little troll. Well, it's he's just in time for the nuclear run that ensues on him by your boy Kyle right here, um, using the FAL. Uh, and and you know what? Rightfully so. That gun was so sick back in the day before all the damage reduction done to it for uh, fast. You fired the gun, the less damage it did. But at any rate, he's just in time. He can get the nutsack too. I mean, anyone used to be able to get it from us. They can still, anyone can still get it. Um, but you know, here it is. This is actually a hundred, a hundred plus. It's a hundred and two and fifteen gameplay on this kid who tries to anti the fuck at us, and he still gets the nuke and uh, several um, unstoppables dropped on his face. Uh, which is always fun because the kid was like the most annoying troll there ever was. Um, but yeah, like I said, I don't know really what happened to them. I, I didn't really have like problems with really anyone else on the team other than him. He just thought he was so good. And it brings me back to the kids who think they're good at games. And, and then they, you know, you just put them in a situation to prove their metal and they're just worth absolutely nothing. Um, and I think that that's... Something to be said, but so it's not so much beef anymore. I don't really care. I let bygones be bygones. It doesn't matter. But this was such a gem of a gameplay. I mean, look, he just gets destroyed. Like, there he is getting just spawn banged over and over and over and over again. And like I said, I mean, you see a lot of these smack and sweaties uh, series. I know Birdman was the first to do them, and I've always enjoyed them uh, to the utmost because I think that it proves... It proves that the people uploading such things are actually decent at the game and can hold their own when push comes to shove against kids who, you know, may be close to the same skill level as they are uh, and, and that they can outplay actual formidable opponents and not just thumbless, uh, mouth-breathing idiots. And there's the nuclear on the wall bang heady. Um, but yeah, these kids, and this is when we used to just terrorize kids on this playlist. 
So you're going to see the final score. It's 102 and 15. Uh, there's also 148 and I, I don't know, another one. The game right before this. You know how you get to play the same map twice in that playlist so you can vote it twice if it's the first time you've seen it. Uh, it was a game before this uh, same map. You might see that later on, but I don't think so because brings me to my next fun point. Um, we have started playing Black Ops 2 again um, in no short order. We had to really get back on this game and, and grind, and we were grinding all day yesterday. And under gamer tags that no one really has any idea what we are. There's sometimes secondary and and even third and fourth accounts for some of us. Just because it's like I said, we were not really like too people didn't really enjoy um, us, especially in the multi team front at its peak. I'm sure half the community's moved on to something else, but the other half that's still there hasn't and, and we were not very very much so well received in that playlist. Therefore, it's very hard for us to play and kind of fly under the radar. So I'm not going to disclose any of those tags to you guys. I'm sure you'll see some gameplays coming from them, in which case I'll probably just blank them out. Um, and, and I think that's just for the better for everyone, because we get to post entertaining content that you guys want to see, and at the same time we don't have to pull our hair out of our heads trying to get that content for you guys. So... I mean, we're all very, like, incredibly low level, and you also know that Prowler is going to be handling Black Ops 2 solo, uh, Prowler out, Prowler hour style, um, starting Friday. He's going to be just sending me a gameplay that he's gotten on Black Ops 2. I'm going to cut it down for him, send it back, and he's going to calm those for you once a week. Obviously, his gameplay is probably different in style from the gameplays you've seen previously, as far as Black Ops 2 goes, where we were going for, like, um, incredibly high, huge scoring, high kill gameplays. Um, I'm pretty sure the style you'll see from him at least is typical Prowler, um, Prowler rampaging, which is really, I'm sure you'll see a lot of high gun streaks, maybe double, triple nuclears. I don't really know what he has in store. He's uh, very secretive in that matter, uh, but I can tell you this much, regardless of what it is, I'm sure it will excite you guys and, and it'll be entertaining to watch as all of his gameplays are. Um, this gameplay is about 8 minutes and 49 seconds long. As you can tell, it's sped up to the same, um, to the same, uh, speed the previous Black Ops 2 gameplay was. It's about 1.15x or 115% of the original, uh, frame rate, um, for Treyarch games. So, yeah, this would have been 11 minutes otherwise, and I want to keep it fresh and entertaining for you guys. So you'll probably either hear from me or Spawn Planks on Wednesday with a ghost gameplay, because we posted two Black Ops now. We'll post a ghost gameplay for you guys. And then Prowler will be back Friday, um, at least tentatively. I can't promise anything, but that's my plan. He'll be back Friday with a Black Ops 2 gameplay of his own uh, and his own commentary for you guys. You guys will see the ending scoreboard here. Uh, very shortly. Um, I have about 20 seconds left. So I hope you guys enjoyed this 100 plus nuclear on a fucking session joining sweatbag motherfucker. Uh, I hope those are fun to watch and, and you guys kind of get on board and get amped up that that kid got the nutsack. But anyway guys, for anything and everything One Nation Gaming, keep it tuned right fucking here. Stay fucking beautiful and like I said, we'll see you Wednesday uh, with a ghost gameplay, whether it be me or Spawn Flanks. And I uh, take it easy.